Let's go up. It's Alfred! Welcome to the training ground. Uh, it's just no fun if you hide. Come on out. I promise not to kill you. Just yet. Cover me! All right. This guy's begging to get his ass kicked. He worked for Umbrella. Nobody, just another face in the crowd. He was a rat. A mole. He tried to leak some data, make some quick cash, but they caught him. And they killed my mother. And then they took me. Steve. It was his fault. He was stupid. He was... Let's go. There's something coming! And it's big! It's coming this way! care of his little pet and he's next I attacked this island upon hearing the news of an awakening but it seems it was a pretense Steve who is it though ironically I feel you will lead me to the truth regardless. Chris's little sister. You're nothing more than a coward! Show yourself, dammit! He... he mentioned my brother's name. Who was that? 
Veronica. The Veronica virus. I can't. I can't remember anymore. My head is ready to explode. Alexia. Please don't be so hard on yourself, brother. We can still have much fun playing our game. Did you hear that? Yeah, she is alive after all. I knew something was wrong. Let's finish this. Alfred was playing two roles all by himself. He couldn't bear the fact that his sister was dead. What is this key for? I guess we'll find out when we reach the airport. How dare you destroy my world. But you did remind me of one very important thing. I no longer need these toys. What now? The cell control system has been activated. All facilities across the island will be terminated. Please evacuate the premises immediately. Terminated? It can't be serious! Sounds like playtime's over. Let's get out of here. Yeah! Actually defeat him. Don't let your guard down just yet. Yeah, we're running out of time. Let's hurry. This is our way off this island. Wait, something is wrong here. We don't have time. Let's go. Code Veronica in progress. Claire! Open gate 2B for takeoff. <laughs> I knew you would lead me to the truth. Get the hell off this damn island! Taking my plane, it will only prove for more entertainment. <laughs> what was that? Something is stuck to the pontoon. I'll go back to the cargo room and take a look. What is this? The only plane yet? It's cheating.
cornered! The seaplane carrying Steve and Claire began to descend and made an emergency landing at an unknown facility, a forgotten site. It was just yet another playground. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm okay. Latitude 82 degrees, 17 minutes south. We're at the South Pole! What? Lock two. Look, there's another one.
I'm surprised you made it this far. Screw you, you crazy bastard! Game over. You're damn right it is. This ends now! It will soon be time for the Queen's awakening. The Queen? You've reached the end of the maze, my little rats. I have to play one more of these games! You have to put an end to this! Ah! Awakening. What does that mean? I don't know. The guy was insane. He said, the Queen's awakening. <sighs> that doesn't sound good. Let's hurry. Okay.
Good job. Let's have some fun. Out of here once and for all. Forgive me, Alexia. I thought I could finish them alone. <laughs> Awaken from your slumber and bring forth the great Veronica. Once Chris disappeared after the mansion incident, he was near impossible to track down. But using my newfound position in the government, I eventually discovered his location. I would have contacted his sister, but she was a ghost herself. So I turned my search over to Claire then, and eventually learned of her confinement on Rockford Island. I shared this information with Chris, and he asked me to arrange a rescue mission before he set off on his own to find her. Claire! Claire! Kidding me? I thought tough girls like you didn't get worried. <laughs> what happened? How did you get here? Leon contacted me. Leon? You know him? Yeah. He tracked me down right after you went missing. Look, Claire, we can talk about this later, but we gotta get out of here first. Wait, Steve, he's here somewhere. We can't leave without him. <sighs> <laughs> You're Alexia Ashford. Oh, you know my name. I thought you were dead. No, I've just been hibernating for 15 years to become one with the Veronica virus. Veronica virus? I still have some experiments to perform. Would you care to play along? <laughs> <laughs> 
Your friend awaits you in the Colosseum. You don't want to be late. <laughs> She injected me with something. I think it's the Veronica virus. She wants to test me, see if I'll obey her orders. Claire, she wants me to kill you. Steve! I won't... kill you! Run for it. No! Claire! We're not gonna give up! Right now we've got no choice! Alright! Good. Let's get upstairs before he catches up. Stop. He's got one hell of a jump! Let's go! I'll be back! I promise! Be careful! Get out through there! this in the power room. I'm coming with you. It's time this ended. Alexia has to be stopped. I'm gonna finish this, Steve. And then we'll all be free. My 
little experiment at the Colosseum was so much fun, don't you think? Yes. Though I guess sometimes a worker ant will turn on his queen. Chris! Are you okay? Oh, that's right. You two are brother and sister, aren't you? I had a brother once, too. He really wasn't much fun. He couldn't even wake me up on time. But I've released him of all his responsibilities. You think everyone in this world is here to serve you, don't you? Serve me? No. I think everyone else is here to serve my experiments. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's start our exciting experiment, shall we? Bad rats aren't meant to run away, you know. How amusing! <laughs> I can feel Veronica surging myself! <laughs> that my only daughter has become obsessed with the Veronica virus. She has even got to the point of experimenting on her own body. My daughter dreams of unleashing this thing into the world. This last step is the only way I can think of to help her. Whether you are on Umbrella's side or not, please help her. Even though it was he who created my brother and I. But he was such a miserable old man. Got it! Oh, 
Dar's knife. But this one looks different from yours. I'm pretty sure I know who it belongs to. Veronica virus, despite Chris's best efforts, was procured by Wesker. He secured Steve's body, which had been infected, and was able to extract the virus, leading to its reappearance in South America. The virus continues to grow, altering its form, strengthening perpetually, until the day comes when it can be destroyed.